Eiffel. London, 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 London. Eiffel. This is Coogan Cassius Fry from London. We're in Glow in Blue Water uh, for the press conference for James DeGale's European title defence, also on the bill, Lenny Dawes. Now, the man you're facing, I'm going to try and pronounce his name, but it might not come out right, Ville Paisparnan. If you're watching this, Ville, I've got it wrong, I'm sorry. Lenny Dawes, how are you? I'm good, yeah. Really looking forward to this fight, the EU title. Um, training's been spot on. Um, studied him quite a bit, so we know it was coming out of Saturday, you know, so... Interesting comments from Mick Hennessy in the press conference when asked about, obviously, you know, you'd like a, another crack at the British, but, you know, you, you, you're ranked second in the EBU, so the European title's more on your mind now at the moment, is it? Oh, most definitely, yeah, because, you know, I know I've only got the one notch to go on the Lonsdale for keep, so that's always an option there we can come back to. So, yeah, if we can jump above it at the moment, let's, let's do it. And as you say, time's ticking, let's make my move now, and I know I can do it. Yeah. Can you tell us a little bit about how training camp's gone leading up to this fight, Lenny? Um, training, we've been in camp for about 10 weeks. Um, plenty of good sparring. Um, throwing new, fresh people in with me. Four, 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 you know, six and six. Not a lot of people can last 12 with me in sparring, so um, we've been really hitting it hard. Um, so I'm, I'm prepared for doing the 12 rounds at a good, good pace. The domestic scene at um, like World what would you make of it at the moment? You know, How competitive do you think it is, obviously? We've got um, not a new champion, but he's the Darren Hamilton recently won the title over Ashley Fearfane, so uh, obviously who you know very well. So, yeah, what do you make of the division domestically at the moment? It's still it's still very busy, um, exciting, um, but yeah, it's, you know it, it's going over old ground all the time. It's, that's what it seems like with me. So, I need new, fresh fighters, someone that's going to have the danger there and bring the best out in me. And I know this fella can do that. And as you say, if we can get a a voluntary maybe we can always come back to that but yeah I'm not going down the eliminator route again it's another year time's ticking you know let's move on to the European title definitely um, we're at this venue glowing blue water new venue um, which is well, it's great for me because I'm 20 minutes up the road and obviously it's, it's great for a lot of people to actually closer you said yourself that yeah. you know you, you'd rather be fighting places that were nearer you know where fans can come and see you obviously as well yeah no, so I've never never been over here so it'd be nice to box here um, yeah, my last three fights have all sort of been, had to travel a little bit. I've been up north, so the fans haven't been there. Um, but yeah, for this one, I've got a big fan base coming. Really looking forward to putting a show on and showing them. Hopefully, we'll definitely be shown on Channel 5. So looking forward to it, definitely. Yeah, that was my next question. The Channel 5 angle, obviously, terrestrial TV, it means that you've only got to own a television set and, and pay your TV license to be able to watch this fight. You know, no subscription things. It's there, bang for everyone to see. No, that's right. There, there'll be a lot of people tuning in. And yeah, a lot of followers watching it, definitely. You know, it's, there's been a lot in the papers about my fight, James DeGale, and it's definitely going to get people tuning in and watching. Mick Hennessy's got quite a stable here at the moment, obviously, um, like I said, with the signing of James DeGale, and there's a lot of talent on Tyson Fury, Kid Galahad, and yourself. So, you know, the stable's looking strong for Hennessy in Channel 5. Oh, most definitely, yeah. As you say, I've been with Mick from day one. Um, and it feels like home, but yeah, they've come, they've gone, and yeah, and it's getting strong again now, entertaining, it's getting some good fighters, so yeah, it's, it's a lovely camp to be with, you know, really interesting. Are you the only ABA champion to ever come out of your gym? I am, yeah. yeah James told me that, yeah. well, he's told me that a few times, and he said, make sure you mention it, I didn't yeah. see really the relevance of mentioning it, but because <laughs> he asked me to mention it, I thought I'd drop it in. Uh, yeah, well, the gym's been going since 1947, and I'm the only one ever to win a senior ABA title. Yeah, mate. Little big picture up there. I have, yeah, yeah. Got a big picture in there, yeah. Um, Will there ever be a picture of James Helder in that gym? Possibly, yeah. Uh, <laughs> if he can put me over. <laughs> Honestly, because obviously Zed's quite large and obviously has to fit. <laughs> yeah, we can get one we to need, fit. Well, we're going to need a big wall for that, anyway, yeah. A big wall. <laughs> what about on the ring? On the ring mat? On the canvas. On the canvas. <laughs> we'll have to see what have we can do. Have a word with Ian. Yeah, we'll have a word, see what we can do down there, yeah. <laughs> All right, Lenny Dawes, listen, thank you very much for talking to iFilm London. Pleasure to interview you. Uh, James always gets to interview, but obviously yeah. it's my turn tonight, so today no. rather, so pleasure to speak to you, sir. No, lovely. Thank you for doing this and getting the getting message out there to everyone. No, cheers. No problem. This is Coogan Cassius with uh, Lenny Dawes. Tickets still available um, somehow. Tickets are available for this show, so get them fast. Yeah. No, thank you and tune in and watch it. Thank you very much. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,